Aaron, did you see that Gardner at bat in the second inning, the walk is a pivotal uh, moment in terms of knocking Price out of the game? It was a really good at bat. I mean, it, you know, that you know you're always going to get that with Gardy. Um, you know, even at times where it's been a little up and down for him, that he just has a way of grinding down in a bat and making making the pitcher really work. And obviously, that was a big at bat and just kind of setting setting things up again and and adding on a little bit there early. Other questions, uh, Dave, to your left, Aaron. Aaron, a lot of the discussion with Gary Khalil in the past weeks has been about his defensive ability, but tonight his kind of game wrecking ability was on display. I mean, this is kind of the the breakout game or the type of performance that you've been, you know, talking about or hoping for, I guess, in the, in the past, yeah. past time. Yeah, um, we know he's capable of that, and uh, you know, first three games into the playoffs too. Um, more, you know, almost more importantly, he's caught. He's caught really well. Uh, I think he's been he's been really good back there, and um, from the receiving, blocking, game planning, all those kind of things. Um, and then tonight, just a, a monster night. And you know, you, you know he's capable of that. We all know he's capable of that, and that's kind of what we've been uh, waiting for to some degree, where he can kind of take over a game on offense. And and he was huge, obviously tonight. Um, I enjoyed it. <laughs> a, little, a little exhale at that point. Uh, Ken. Aaron, uh, the importance of Tanaka's outing and with his pitch count so low, is there any thought to bring him back out for the sixth? No, no. We he was uh, we had Dellen up and ready, and and had Mookie come up to bat even in the fifth as the tying run there, we would have gone and gotten him and brought in Dellen right there. So, but Moss was terrific, set the tone. Um, you know, really mixing, really efficient with his pitches, mixing early um, command. You know, the Red Sox they they do a really good job of. You know, putting the ball in play, and you know they they can be a tough out, especially even when he's got his split. But it was five strong innings for us to really set set us up in a good position, and and fortunately we we're able to add on once he got out of there. We'll take two more before we bring Aaron's players in. Tyler, Aaron, when when did you kind of come to the come around to the idea that you know four or five innings from a starter with this kind of bullpen is all you're looking for. We saw Severino the other night kind of go as hard as you can until you get to those guys. And why is that the right play for, for this kind of team? Well, you know, one of our overwhelming strengths is is our bullpen. And when you get into these postseason, these postseason games, um, <clears throat> You know, especially when you have some off days sprinkled in, so <clears throat> you don't worry as much about workload. You know you can protect guys. Um, you just kind of weigh what matchups you like better, especially as you get to, you know, the second, third time through an order. If you're lined up in the, in the bullpen with the guys we're able to run out there, um, you know, we're going to do that on a lot of different nights. Um, you know, that said, I'm, um, I'll be happy to if, if, uh, if, if a starter can go out there and, and give a seven or eight strong, I'm in on that too. But we're going to be really aggressive, especially around off days when our guys we feel like are, are rested and ready to go. Take a last one for Aaron. <coughs> Nothing out. Uh, Tyler. What would a starter have to do to get the chance to go seven, eight for you guys? I mean, it seems like you're always going to have those good relievers. Um, it, it may, <coughs> excuse me. It may be score dictated, you know. Um, it may be, you know, how efficient, how easy it seems like they're they're going through lineups, things like that. I mean, there's so many things that go into it. Um, so I wouldn't rule it out, but we'll be aggressive when our guys we feel like are lined up that we can roll them out.